Hey guys, Kevin Muldoon here. Over the last few days I've been uploading a lot of gaming videos to my channel. This is something that I've been wanting to do for a while. I'm a big gamer, I love playing games and the idea of interacting with other gamers at the same time really appeals to me. Now you may have noticed that the audio on these recordings have been, has been very, very good. A lot of people use headsets and sometimes they sound okay but other times I feel that they, they sound a little tinny. What I'm going to do is show you how I've been recording audio. This is the Blue Yeti. And can twist it up here. Um, this is a blackout version. It's a fantastic USB microphone from the company Blue. Looks great. Comes with its own stand. The quality is very, very good. Now, just a few things to note here. In the back of this microphone, it has four different settings. It's got stereo, omnidirectional. Uh, it's got cardioid and it's got bi-directional. The option that you want if you're connecting it to the PS4 is cardioid. And what that means is that it's only going to record this way. By and large, that is, is kind of how it works. But it, it can still pick up a little bit of sound. It's just the way the microphones work, you know, with audio and things like that. But it will pick up audio from one direction rather than all around or from two different directions. I'm going to show you how I connect it to my PS4 quickly and just in case some of you have been having trouble with this first thing to note is that the, the Blue Yeti retails for about £100 in the UK or $100 in the US it comes with this extremely large cable and that's going to be really handy because you don't want to have to sit right next to your PlayStation so you plug it in one end and then what we'll do is we'll go to the PS4 so Come over here, got my white PS4 here, all we do is, put it in the right way, plug it in, now when you plug it in, you should see a message about it being connected soon, there you go, so, I'm in the right, I'm in the, the right screen here, but I'll just come out just now, see when you're in the main screen, all you have to do is you go up, all the way to settings, and you scroll down to devices and you go into the screen that was on before go down to audio devices and then you've got your input and output devices now you can see the, the input device that comes up the PlayStation camera because I've got that sitting up there but I want to keep it as the Blue Yeti now the output device you can put it as your TV but the problem is you'll get some feedback when I'm talking like this you'll get an echo when you do that. So you want to set it through the Yeti. Now there's another option what you can do for your output. So I'll just quickly set you up here. Apologize for that. Don't want to get you the crotch shot. So what you I recommend doing now is this. We have a few different options when it comes to audio with the PS4. There's um there's some things you can do with a digital uh, out a uh, port at the back and things like that. But one of the most common ways would be to get your controller and just simply put your headphone into the bottom of the controller. Now I was actually quite pleased when I did that. With um, I was quite pleased with the quality of the audio going directly through the controller. But there's a big downside to that. It's much, much better to go through the Blue Yeti. Now, the bottom of the Blue Yeti, you have your headphone jack. So you plug that in, and then you're going to have the audio from the game, all the, all the audio coming down, going through the Blue Yeti. Now, the benefit to that is this, the volume, the volume control here. When you plug your, your headphone through your controller, if you're playing a game, you need to go into the menu system, you need to go down to the audio control, you need to adjust the volume control of your headphones. It's not difficult to do, but it will take you know a few button presses and you do have to go through the menu system. If you've got this set in front of you, you've got the microphone on your table sitting like this, you've got it sitting here, and at any point of the game, of your recording, you can just put the volume 
of the game, up or down. And that's something I've been using a lot because there's certain times in the games where, you know, the sound's a little bit louder or quieter and you can turn it down so that you can, you can still play the game and record. So I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. Very straightforward in how you do this with the, the Blue Yeti. Works great out of the box. One thing we say is, I've read a lot of people saying that the Yeti Pro does not work with the PS4 because it requires high, uh, it requires, I think it's like high power USB charging or something, and, or it needs USB 3 or something like that. So I would only, I would opt for the Blue Yeti instead. It's a great microphone. A lot of the pros are using this to record videos. So if you're going to be streaming games, I do recommend looking into this. It's plug and play, and I've been very, very pleased with it. If you get any questions about how all, all of this works, please do ask a question below in the comment area and I will do my best to answer them. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, please do consider liking, sharing or subscribing. Till next time guys, thanks for watching.